Hello YouTubers and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars comparison. And today we're going to take a look at the two cruising Lightning McQueens inaccurate version versus accurate version which by the way this version came with Doc Hudson which I got in a two pack yesterday from Amazon. Now before we get right into the review you or the discussion or the unboxing let me discuss something so this no, so here we got the packaging we have Doc Hudson and Cruising Lightning McQueen's artwork although I've already reviewed Doc Hudson so basically so basically I may have a use for one of the two, whether if I sell it or sell one of them or customize one of them. But anyhow, here we've got the red desert background and the blue sky and the old cars logo and their the art their artworks and the die casts in self inside and the metal logo and and we got Doc Hudson and Cruising Lightning McQueen, Rail Lightning McQueen, in De Passio, Flash McQueen Sport, or Relampago McQueen Red Vadu, and the Metal logo and the Mattel logo. And on the back, we've got we've got the Cars logo. And the cars that come in two packs, which I believe the two packs are only sold exclusively at Target stores. We've got Race Official Tom in Cars 1 Lightning McQueen, Flo and Ramon, Dinoco Mia and Dinoco Tia, Floyd Mulvihill and Krusty Rodor, and Lightning McQueen and Mater, but Take note that this Lightning McQueen is the road repair version, while this meter here is a ha, is the tow hook variant, which by the way, I believe the meter right here has a working actual working tow hook. Excuse me. So here we've got the Mattel logo and the RSN logo saying RSN Racing Sports Network. And now without any further ado, let's let's start unboxing. So now, here we've got the two Cruising Lightning McQueens. It's inaccurate version versus accurate version. So now let's... And now for the comparisons. Here are some similarities and differences. Both are Lightning McQueen, and both bear the dark red Corvette style paint job, and the sm smiling expression, the headlight stickers, no tampos on the hood, no name signature, no number, 95, no spoiler, here we've got the the red rims on the white wall tires and 
the exhaust pipes and the gas cap no sponsor logos or 95 just the half white oval with a small yellow lightning bolt and here we've got the the taillight stickers but here's another difference no bumper stickers on the back bumper bumper stickers on the back bumper which sing San, Bern San Bernardino Barstow and Kingsman but take note that the bumper stickers were the bumper stickers that Lightning got from Lizzie and now and now for the undercarriage it says China well this one says Thailand and take note that this is has a hole underneath which I believe it it works for a tow hook for a, or should I say Mater's tow hook let's see yep it, yep oh yep it works so so anyhow this bumper sticker variant came as a single back in 2020 as part of the blue desert series and and it came then in during the COVID-19 pandemic then the following year in 2021 during the 10th anniversary of Cars 2 and the 15th anniversary of the first Cars film it came in a two-pack with Sally and for this year it came in a two-pack with Doc Hudson and this version right here is more brighter compared to this Chinese version so which one is the so who I mean so who's the real Cruising Lightning McQueen? I am. Now hold on there, hold on. So I believe that this McQueen has the more accurate detailing considering the the bumper stickers right here. And Hmm. So I believe that this McQueen is the winner. So, Saranara China Cruising Lightning McQueen. Hello, Thailand Cruising Lightning McQueen. But what do you guys think? Which version of Cruising Lightning McQueen is your favorite? Which one has the more accurate detailing? And which one is the, re the true winner? Let me know what you think, as well as leaving suggestions of which card to review you next in the comments down below. And if you have enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Also, don't forget to check out some of my other videos on my channel. And I hope to see you all guys next time for another review, so please stay tuned. Goodbye now!